the Mayo table technique in hip arthroscopy. How to perform the arthroscopic dynamic impingement test for hip maximal range of motion on a fracture table. We have no disclosures. The instruments utilized for this technique are number one, a hip fracture table, number two, a mayo table, and number three, a pillow or some blankets. We perform hip arthroscopy in the modified supine position with the boot out of the fracture table clamp and we place it over a well cushioned mayo table. The purpose of this technique is to evaluate the cam deformity and where is impinging on the acetabulum. This dynamic test and hip maximal range of motion is done preoperatively, intraoperatively or arthroscopically and post decam decompression. Here you can observe the arthroscopic dynamic impingement test which is tested pre-femoral osteochondroplasty and post-femoral osteochondroplasty. Afterwards the boot is placed on the hip fracture table clamp to start distraction under arthroscopic vision. And to work on the central compartment of the hip. Thank you so much for your attention.